Welcome back one and all to Fire Emblem Three Houses. I am the Dark Seraph. Last time, we basically did some preparation for the mission of the month. This time, oh, I found out that Axel having allowed has the Imperial is Army to invade, why he can't use it. The Alliance Army makes their last stand at the center of House Regan territory in Deirdre. The Kingdom Army rushes to their aid after amassing more troops. Good to see Claude again. The citizens of Deirdre have all been evacuated and are now at sea. Good. Are you sure about this? If Deirdre were to fall, those ships don't have enough resources for... Deirdre won't fall. Have some faith in me, will you? Oh, yes, sir. Our line of defense has been broken. The Imperial Army will be here any moment. Understood. You two join up with the troops in the city. Yes, sir. Judith, are you ready? As ready as I'll ever be. It's been years since I last battled in the city streets. Don't go messing up because your vision is weakened with age. Take the defensive for now. Yeah, yeah, I get it. You hang in there too, boy. Your wounds from Granderfield haven't fully healed yet, have they? No, but it's not like I can sit this one out. I have to make my daring escape, after all. Yet for the last time, stop calling me boy. That's an official order from the leader of the Alliance. Understood, leader man. I wonder if a little wave will show up. We fought on opposite sides at Gronder, didn't we? They'll come. You can count on it. If anyone can bring him back, it's Teach. Teach will talk and he'll listen. But more than anything, I've seen their skill and their abilities. I believe in them. Claude, reinforcements are coming from the West. Their banner is that of the Kingdom. What did I tell you? They're here and just in time. Let it be known, it I feel horrible about killing the classmates a lot. And the Alliance classmates. As far as Berendetta, it seems the Imperial advance I feel horrible about killing Berendetta, but I didn't have a the choice! The forces are holding out, but they won't last much longer. That must be Judith, the Pals Daphnel, who joined up with Claude's troops. To think Judith, a true hero, would find herself backed into a corner like this. Men fight their hardest when backed into the corner. And yes, that would apply to Judith. I'm using that in terms of the race of man, you know, humanity, humankind. You see, what I'm, you know what I'm getting at. You know what I mean. It is not so. The alliance has only drawn the enemy so deeply into the city to allow us to attack them from behind. Brilliant. A Spencer attack. I believe so. He put his soldiers into position purely on the belief that we'd come. I can't believe Claude would risk everything on that belief. I can't believe Claude would risk everything on that belief. He has placed all of his hopes on us. Let's make sure we live up to his expectations, Professor. Let's kick some ass. Here we go. Let's move. When you are backed against the wall. I, I don't remember the lyrics to the song. That's the song Halo by Starset, but I don't remember the rest of the lyrics. Back to wall, against the wall. I could be the one who's always there to break your fall. I don't remember the song. It's not a bad song. Yeah, it's a great time to remind me of all the ins and outs of fishing. Thank you, game, and I'm not a fan of these loading times. Well, Ingrid, you better make yourself useful. That's all I'm going to say. Let's see if I have a better shield for you. No, you need it, Sylvain. That's... Anyway, as I was saying... This axe 
cannot be used by Sylvain. Take a look at the map. There's Judith. Good to see Hilda still in one piece. Liking the new Wyvern, Claude. Arndell. This is going to be one hell of a fight. I'm not seeing any mages, you know, other than Arndell. So, I'm going to be real careful with Ingrid, but she could prove useful. All right, let's fight. Prepare yourselves. And I can't let Claude fall. The leader of the Alliance has managed to escape to the harbor, has he? Those rats resist in vain. Your Excellency, there's an army closing in on us from outside. The banners are those of House Blathed. Blathed? I see. That idiot failed, it seems. Hurry up and kill the leader of the Alliance. With him gone, Deirdre will fall. Oh, I don't think so. I will not let Claude die. Let's hurry to his rescue. Hey, you're late. Hurry up and help. Again, I'm sorry about all your classmates, man. I That, that, that was a hard situation. I feel horrible about that. Hunter's Volley. Oh, that actually allows a follow-up. I'm still here. S plus. I've made it. What's my strategy? Don't needlessly throw yourself in harm's way. Leave it to me. Flame, be a deer and pull him out. I'll cut through. I'm your girl. I am prepared. My orders? What's the plan? At your service. Ready when you are. Claude's nuts. Asking me to protect the bridge? That's so much responsibility. Hilda. I'm so helpless, I feel sorry for him. So, I'll do what I can to protect him. Just split some skulls. <laughs> You're making me work. Never could have opened with that, you know. All is going to plan. All I'm saying, you could open with that. Another victory. Let's go. That is basically no hit chance. It's about what I expected to happen. Don't waste it. Good God, they're picking on me now.
The subjugation of Deirdre is complete. We will be joining the main army now. Ah, they're showing up one after another. Nothing for it but to blockade the gate leading to the town. I don't want the enemy's numbers to increase any more. It's no good. We're surrounded. But I need to hurry up and rescue the boy. To get to the harbor, first we have to get rid of the enemy mercenaries. There's no other way. That's how you open with a crit, honey. Nice work. Thanks. Oh, that's a mortal savant. I'm impressed. Much needed. Out of curiosity, what does the lamppost shield do? I like having the shield on him, I'm just curious what it does. So, I'm breaking the flow here, but I'm looking it up. Lamppost shield, fire emblem, wow, first result. Plus three defense. That's not that great. That, honestly, I think I'm gonna have Ingrid come in and trade that shield with Byleth. I think that would be my best thing. I think that'd be my best bet. We need to hold those highlighted points. Not so fast. Oh, that's bad. Thank you. That was a big help. I'll go and cover our leader. Let's go. You're gonna keep trying this. Obvious. Oh God! Oh, fighting wears me out. Don't get used to this. Can't afford to slack off. Appreciate it. They're doing a pretty good job of holding their point. Send the iron shield to the convoy. I don't see that being useful. This could turn the tides. So coming. Let's see you got this. It is done. Just like that.
One to remember. Shoot you down. Look, the Imperial Army Supply Corps. Attacking now would be a fine plan. In the name of justice! It was the only way. A silver bow broke, but an Aurora shield. Three protection, a shield that grants divine protection from projectiles. Oh! Oh, 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 oh. That is going on you. Here is something to believe in. It won't be in vain. You need that. I'll use that's the same protection the Ebola shield gives you. Come on, crit for me, baby. Whatever it takes. Thank you, Sylvain! believe they pushed through to here. Nothing is more foolish than dying in vain. Let's get to the harbor and finish off the leader of the Alliance. Another victory. There's still these guys. An axe of Zoltan. I kind of want to send someone after those. That's going to be you. doubted you. Burn until we meet again.
won't be in vain. This... Nothing bites so hard as a cornered rat, eh? wasn't in vain. I misread that. I can't lose. I'm still here. It had to be done. to lose. Wait. My dad's really into the game. Hate me if you must. the next battle. Such a good girl, Flying. I won't 
falter. me if you must. Strength. It's kind of sad, not gonna lie. Steal myself. It was meant to be. Actually, that'd be good on you now that I think about it. He's unarmed right now. I know this isn't interesting, but I want to talk to Claude. Yeah, I know. Professor, if you had chosen me instead of Dimitri, no, I shouldn't dwell on it. I'm grateful you came. I'm glad to have your strength, if only for today. Time to finish it. I can't lose. Do our hopes end here? I'll keep moving forward. Uncle, I need to know. The incident nine years ago. You were involved, weren't you? 
You know something. What did Cornelia... No. What did my stepmother do? You are not qualified to look into the darkness. You and Edelgard. Do your best to kill each other. You are family after all. There it is. The light. What a dick! Nice work, Ash. You protected Hilda and Judith. A giant shell. And go to the convoy. Convoy. He's dead. There goes our chance to gain more information. And again, even if we had managed to capture him alive, judging by the way he was acting. We can think about that later. Teach is absolutely right. We should take this rare opportunity to let off some tension. Claude. It's been a long time, Claude. I'm glad to see that you're safe. Same. I haven't seen you since the nightmare that was Grander. She really did come to help us. You must be a bunch of soft-hearted suckers, huh? Kinda. If you really felt that way, you would not have set up a defensive battle in the hopes that we would come. It worked out only because we made it in time. Were you really so confident that we would answer the call? Of course. I knew you wouldn't hesitate to put yourself second and come running to our aid. You know him well. You and I are cut from different cloth. I wouldn't make a move unless I could gain something from it. You've always been just the opposite. And of course, I've always been fond of taking dangerous risks. After all, I sent that express messenger before you had even recaptured the kingdom capital. If all went to plan, I knew you'd recapture it soon, and then respond to our request for aid. It was riskier than usual, I'll give you that. But it was the only card I had to play, so I took the gamble. You crossed too many dangerous bridges from my liking. I know, I know. But that ends today. What do you mean? Here. Take this. Use it however you see fit. Your bow? Legendary bow, fail not. Isn't this the hero's relic of House Regan? Hold, Claude. This must be one of your jokes. You cannot truly intend to part with this. We can't even make use of it. Unless the Crest of Flames can. It's not a joke. As of today, the Lester Alliance is no more. Just what are you planning, Claude? If you're going to lead Fodlan, then the Alliance Lords will follow you. Back in the day, the Alliance split off from the Kingdom. I'm just putting us back together again. Oh, and I've already gained the support of the other Lords at the Roundtable Conference, so you can stop looking at me like I'm crazy. All that's left for me is to officially step down as the leader of the Alliance. Will you join our army? Hold your horses there, Teach. <clears throat> I wish you forward. would. There are things I have to do. Dreams I need to see to fruition. That's why I became the Alliance leader to begin with, actually. But it left me no time for what I was really after. You'd better not take on too many responsibilities yourselves, or else you'll end up in the same boat. And remember, both the living and the dead cling to us without any regard for our own lives. It's up to us to break free of that weight and follow the path that we believe in. Claude. Oops. I almost forgot the most important thing. If you're looking for Rhea, apparently she's being held captive in the Imperial capital. I can kind of put like two and two together. To her, but there's no telling <clears throat> what they're planning. You have my gratitude, Claude. Gratitude? Thanks, but no thanks. As far as I'm concerned, we're even now. I don't know how many years will pass until then, but let's promise to meet again. And when we do, don't be too hard on me, your kingliness. I'm curious if I can actually make use of that. Well, Dimitri, are you finally going to tell us the damn truth? What are you talking about? 
Didn't Lord Arendelle say something about you and Edelgard being family? To claim that the King and the Emperor are related, could it be? Ah, I suppose I never told you, though I do recall mentioning it briefly to the Professor. Lord Arendelle spoke the truth. My stepmother was Edelgard's birth mother. Political turmoil drove my stepmother out of the Empire. Father fell in love with her at first sight, and they married. I lost my birth mother before I was old enough to remember her. My stepmother filled that role for me, but she lost her life in Dusker nine years ago, along with father. She set that up, by the way. Hang on. I didn't even know she was your stepmother. Did my father know about this? I don't know. Yes. All those who were close to my father knew, including Rodrigue. But to speak openly about it would have caused a scandal. And so she was our secret. No one in the general public knew about her. Naturally, the fact that Edelgard and I are step-siblings was kept a secret as well. I'm finally beginning to understand what you went through five years ago. I mean, Edelgard is the only family you have left, isn't she? To find out someone so precious to you is actually your most hated enemy. How heartbreaking. But wait! You two were born and raised in two different territories, right? So you probably never met until you were both at the Academy. I mean, don't get me wrong. I think the idea of fighting family is just about the worst thing ever. But hopefully the fact that she's a stepsister who you never really knew helps with the pain? I don't know. It was just a thought. I'm afraid that's not the case. Though it was only for a short time, Edelgard once called Ferdia at home. It was a long time ago, but she was a cherished friend of mine. Wait! I remember now! She was that girl, wasn't she? The one you gave a dagger to! <laughs> so, your little girlfriend was Edelgard. Sylvain, if you have any more foolish things to say, please hold them for later. I do have a few more in my sleeve, but they can wait. <laughs> this is important for us to hear. I like Sylvain. I, I really do like Sylvain, even if he is a bit of a dick. She may be a hated enemy now, but the Emperor is your old friend and your stepsister. Can you bring yourself to kill her? I will kill her, if I must. But if there is any chance that the world she seeks to create could be a just one, then I... I would love to see a future in which I may reach out my hand for her and have her reach back. That said, I have no intention of letting my personal feelings cloud my judgment. Too much is at stake. Your Highness, I think you should meet with the Emperor and at least try to talk to her. If there's any hope of ending this war without more bloodshed, we have to try. Besides, killing your own family. I'm sorry, but it's not right. You speak from experience. I... I think so too. And you are right that we should at least try. I see. So my uncle's defeat is beyond doubt? Yes, Your Majesty. I have confirmed it via countless channels. I advise that we accept this as a drop of joy amid a pool of sorrow. Pretty words, but I'm afraid we can't rest until the joy outweighs the sorrow. And for that to happen, it now seems we must confront them all at once. Dimitri, who took back Ferdiad. Claude, who managed to protect the Alliance. And that professor, who is successfully mobilizing the Knights of Saros. What will you do, Your Majesty? Pull back our forces. In the west to Arian Road. In the east to... Fort Mercius, I presume. There is no better place for such a confrontation, after all. Indeed. And dispatch the Death Knight to guard it. He can buy us some time. In the meantime, I will... Forgive me, but I must speak bluntly. I do not agree with what you intend to do. Though slight, there is a chance that once done, it cannot be undone. Even I cannot always choose the direction my path leads me. There is no other way. And so, I must walk on. This is some really heavy stuff. I'm gonna get in this one here. Thank you all for watching. Join me next time on Fire Emblem Three Houses as I make my way to Fort Marcius after some preparations. But until then, I am the Dark Seraph, signing off.